Hey everyone, Ash here for the Triple S League, and welcome to this Ghostwire Tokyo guide for summoning Tengu. If you've played the game for a little while, you know there are Tengu that hover above buildings that you can grapple onto and uh, use to reach higher heights. Well, you may not be aware that there is an ability that you can unlock that allows you to actually summon them basically wherever you want, although they can only be summoned on the tops of buildings. But you can summon them in any building you want, not just where they are, uh, you know, already placed throughout the city. And I would recommend getting this ability as early as possible. It makes moving around the city and getting up to high places just so much easier. It's pretty expensive, though. It costs 7 Magatama to uh, open up the ability. I saw a website that said it only costs 1, and I wonder if that was a pre-release thing. Because it cost me 7. And then it costs 45 skill points to actually get the skill itself. So it's not something you can get right away, but I would recommend saving up and getting it as quickly as possible, because it's really helpful. Now, as far as actually using the ability, you zoom in as if you were going to grapple to an ordinary Tengu, and if you're zoomed in on a spot where a Tengu can be summoned, you'll see the ghost of one appear, and then you press your jump button to summon it and then grapple to it. Now, they can only be summoned on the edges of roofs, so it doesn't matter if you're looking up or you're looking down, uh, you have to be looking at the edge of a roof, and like I said, it'll show you if a Tengu can be summoned there, and uh, then you can grapple to it. So you can see how this makes getting around a lot easier, makes collecting all those spirits on top of buildings a lot easier. And if there's a rooftop that's just a little bit out of reach, like you can't uh, get it to summon a Tengu there, you can actually use this ability while gliding. So while you're gliding, holding down the jump button to glide, just uh, zoom in at your target destination, and then uh, if, a, if a Tengu appears, you can quickly release and press the jump button to grapple to it right out of a glide. And the nice thing is if you miss, there is uh, no fall damage. So anyway, I hope you found this helpful. Please slam that like button if you did. Maybe give us a subscribe and check out all the links in the description to all of our various Triple S League stuff. Really appreciate you watching today, and I will talk to you again very soon. Did you enjoy that video? Let us know by slamming that like button and leaving a comment below. And if you really liked it, consider joining the Triple S Legion by joining our online community, supporting us on Patreon, or checking out the merch store. Subscribe for tons more guides and other fun videos, and for insightful gaming news content, check out our sister channel, Triple S Podcast. Oh, what?